Hello DC fans, this is JAR369. Welcome back for another figure review. Today I'll be taking a look at the McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse Gold Label Wally West, aka Kick Flash, made by McFarlane Toys. So take a look at the packaging, just the usual DC Multiverse packaging. You can see the window exposing the figure and the accessories, and you can see gold label right there and you can see it says DC Multiverse get flash you get the name DC's rebirth on the other side same just the name by itself on the back there's a cool artwork image of Kit Flash so that's about it let's take out Kit Flash out of the package here is Kit Flash out of the package let's take a closer look at the figure uh take a look at the head sculpt I would say yeah, he looks really not too bad. Very well like the character from the comics. Well, to be honest, I only knew this character from the Arrowverse TV show. So yeah. Yeah, I'm not a real comic book fan. Yeah, go ahead in the comments down below. I'm not a comic book fan. I'm not a real comic book fan. But anyway, the figure itself, the head sculpt looks really good. Not too bad at all. Not too bad. You like the, the reverse flash type ears. Well, obviously they're... Flash's ears but in red. Still really not too bad. You can see like the teeth right there, like where the lips are. The hair scope, nothing much. You can, like the little I'm um, little right here. Dang. Look at that hair. Look at that scope on the hair though. Yeah, I'm pretty sure oh well, yeah, there's like the, there's a picture of the card. Oh yeah, it was supposed to be look like the Flash logo, but Todd here. Come on. I mean, look at that. That that ain't look good. Like, like look at that, man. That's really, that's a really a bad haircut, I would say. Yeah, on by the looks of the comics, it looks really good. Like, looks really good on there, but on the figure, yeah, man. Yeah, Todd, maybe it's best for you to not give action figures with, like, some sort of a logo on their hair, like, hair on there, because, man, it looks pretty bad. But the head scope looks really good, I would say. And take a look at the body here. I'm pretty sure this is the, exactly the same body as the reverse flash, but I think the diaper piece thing is different, and... The lower legs, I believe it's different. Yeah, you get the Kit Flash logo right there. No peg hole in the back there. You get the gloves. You get like the running pose gloves right here. And you get the, like some sculpted muscles on the arms and the legs and everywhere. You get the boots. And the the ball joints are not, not really ball joints anymore, so... A, I really wish Todd can continue on. Still really not too bad on the on the ball the choice of the ball joints on there. Uh you see some of the lightning like the boots there, some sculpting to it. Same on the lower feet there. And on the bottom there's some legalese and two pegos in the bottom of his feet there. Overall for the figure itself, it's a really a cool looking figure I would say. McFarlane did a really a great job with this figure, and I'm very happy that we finally that I finally got a a cla a kit a classic Kit Flash figure. I know he made like the one that's exclusively to Walmart, but I'm not too familiar too familiar of that version of Wally West, and another one blue. Also not familiar, but thankfully this is the more I'm more familiar with this character from. From the um, the Arrowverse show, yeah. Anyway, take a look at the articulation. The head does go fully rotate. Ball joint there. Arms do go fully rotate. Does go in and out. And there's like a little butterfly ball joint there. Arms fully rotate. Double jointed elbows. The wrists to rotate. The lower wrist and the hinge. Upper wrist there too. Chest rotation. Waist. Bit stiff, legs kick forward and back in and out, upper leg rotation, double jointed knees, 
the egg sort of kicks its own behind. There's the boot upper leg feet rotation there. Angles pivot forward back and angle pivot side to side and also toe articulation. Just a standard DC multiverse articulation, but you can still give this guy some great amount of action possibility. Accessories, he does come with quite a few accessories. He does come with some of the running effect pieces. You can see one for the arms and you get two for the arms and two for the legs. Which for the legs, it's a bit looks a bit difficult like how to put it in. You probably open probably and then there. Not sure to be honest. And he does come with an interchangeable hands, the fisted hands that uh, you can spoke yeah, have him pose him with the runny and then punch look. And just like standard McFarlane toys. He does come with a trading card of the picture of the character and on the back. Here's the bio. Here's the bio of the character. And there's the read up. Go ahead, pause the video if you want to read it. And also the display stand. Well, that's okay for me because I'm going to display, display him like in his running pose. So which I'm going to do that right now. There we go. And there you have Kid Flash running in the running pose. Yeah. Yeah, I might display him like that. But overall, for the figure itself, I actually do really like this figure. Yeah, McFarlane Toys did a really awesome job with this figure. The um, the head sculpt looks really good. The the sculpt on the body looks really good. I'm pretty sure it's exactly the same body as some of the previous Flash figures. Well, the only one, the only Speedster figure I have was the Reverse Flash. But at the end of the day, it's still really a great figure. Interchangeable hand, just the usual. The effects looks a bit different than the previous Flash figures that I've reviewed. But overall, it's a really not too bad figure, I would say. I do recommend getting this figure at the McFarlane Toys website. This figure is exclusively to the McFarlane Toys website, so I would I would definitely recommend getting this figure. For my rate, I'm gonna give the Kit Flash figure, I'll give it like a, a nine out of 10 for me. I hope you go. I hope you guys enjoyed my review. If you did, please consider like, comment, share, and subscribe if you're new to my channel. And follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Both links will be in the description down below. That's all I have to say. This is the DC Multiverse Gold Label Kit Flash figure made by McFarlane Toys. And this is JAR369. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you on my next review. And remember, keep on collecting.